So, do you <sighs> feel like playing a game? Not really, but sure. Don't worry. I'm not that good of a player. Okay. Uh, let's auto match, why not? I'll just accept. Kind of. Kind of wish I had looked at the thing, actually. Um. Some sort of data. How to play Caravan. Caravan decks are comprised of at least 30 cards from one or more traditional. Okay, the deck may have any number of cards and any type of suits. Though it cannot have duplicate cards from the cave. Okay. It, it doesn't sound that fun to me, actually. Yeah. He doesn't look very tough, though. I hear he's afraid I'll shoot him down from one of the windows when I see him. And he's right. I'll have a much bigger problem once his friends show up. There's no way I can handle all of them in a gunfight. I'm gonna lay low for as long as I can, assuming the town doesn't throw me to the wolves. I've got no chance against the gang on my own. Um, all right. Well, I thought it was gonna be like a an easy. Oh, okay, we here we just go. end up sharing the same grave if it's just the two of us. Now, if some of the other people in town were also on board, start with Sunny Smiles. She's been friendlier than most around here. Okay, so we will go get Sunny Smiles. <laughs> We're gonna play. We're gonna play ping pong quest for a little bit. We're gonna go back and forth. We're definitely gonna go back and forth looking for people to help us. I guess Sunny Smiles will be the the third and I guess the deal breaker. Like three people is way better than two for some reason. Where the hell is Sunny Smiles at anyway? Oh, did she just make it back? Hi, well, that's convenient. Been around Good Springs for a while longer. Sure, why not? Say no more. I'm in. Oh! Joe Cobb talks about leaving us alone if we hand over Ringo. But I know his type. He and his friends will come after the town eventually. However, between you, me, and Ringo, we aren't exactly a force to be reckoned with. A lot of people around here look up to Trudy. If you could convince Trudy to join us, some of the folks in town might decide to help out as well. I know Easy Pete's got a stock of dynamite somewhere. And Chet just got a shipment of leather armor we could borrow. Talk to them as well. Son of a bitch. Um, there's a good chance we'll all end up with extra holes in us. So if Doc Mitchell could cough up some extra stim packs, that'd be great. Oh my god. A silver tongue would help. Convincing Trudy that we had a good plan to win the fight would also help. Okay. I don't think give is in Chet's vocabulary. Even with the town at stake, he'd still make you barter with him. And how can I get Pete's dynamite? Easy Pete's pretty protective of his dynamite. You'd have to convince him you know a thing or two about explosives before you handed it over. Son of a bitch. Not in good springs, no. But if you're up for a little scavenging, there's always the schoolhouse. Most of what's in there is junk, but there's this old safe that even Easy Pete wasn't able to crack with dynamite. If you want to take a shot at it, take these. I did not see... I, I did not see... I did not see that safe. If the lock's too much for you to handle... Reading through the magazine might give you the edge you need. Sure. Always happy to help someone down on their luck. Okay. So, we have a lot of stuff to do that has just piled in. Wait a minute, is that Cheyenne or... Okay, I was like, random coyote walking towards me. Oh, shit. Um, locks... Okay, that's for that. I probably need that salesman book... I don't know who sells it. I can't remember if, if Trudy sells it or if it's someone else. Someone sells. I saw a, like a salesman. I don't know if that's barter or charisma. My charisma is pretty good anyway. I'm pretty sure I put one of the uh, one of the points into it. So you're planning on taking on Joe Cobb's gang? It's a big risk, but I suppose you have to do what you think is right. Level up. Goodbye. <laughs> I'm going to level up first. Fuck you, game. Ah, my speech is only... 
Okay, let's boost that up to 30 for now. Guns. Also up to 25. Oh shit, my explosives is <laughs> so shitty. Oh man. Um. Oh, fucking explosives. Okay. Sure, let's put that into there. Continue! Confirmed Bachelor. In combat, you 10 plus damage against male opponents. Okay, no thanks. That could be good. No thanks. No. Um, 10%. Okay, I think I'd rather go with this. And then boost my intelligence. Why not? Sounds good to me. Alright. Feeling thirsty? I can take care of that. Speech. You should help me take down the power gang. I will I will go into this. I was planning on sitting this one out, but for some reason, I can't help but like you. I'm with you. Yeah. Let me have a word with a few other folks, and I'll see if I can't round up some more members for this militia you're creating. While everyone does own a gun, we could stand to be a little better equipped. The general store probably has what we need in stock. Sure. Okay, so now we have to, uh... Howdy. God damn it. Sunny smiles. So now we have to go and, um... Okay, that is not the door I'm looking for. Go to the general store and talk to Chet. Let's go and talk to Chet real quick. Oh, dang it. Uh, let's go talk to Chet. See if we can't uh, get him to supply us some armor and some other stuff. Silver Rush. We sell weapons. Fully charged with no extra charge. What's up, Chet? You looking to buy some supplies? I'm looking for help. Now just hold on. I never voted to take on the powder gangers. That's a thousand cap investment you're talking about. A thousand caps? It's barter. Look. Oh, I'm you fucking douche. Yourselves. There's no way I'm getting involved. But hey, I'm sure you can buy what you need. God damn it. This again? Like I said, I'm against taking on the powder gangers. My supplies aren't cheap, you know. What a douche. That sucks. Do you need the full on, like, number that it wants? I thought that was just like you had a better chance of getting it. of getting it, uh, successfully if you had a higher number. I didn't think you would actually need the full number to be able to to get him to uh, to side with us. Oh man, that was that was annoying. All right, where's this dude? Here he is. Don't you dare sit down. Get up and talk to me. Welcome back. I had hope you wouldn't need to come see me again so soon. What can I do for you? Sure. Let's ask him this. Seems like wherever I go, it's always the same. Folks just never leave each other alone. Oh, I'm not much good in a fight with my bum leg. And my supplies are scarce, but I'll give you what I can spare. Sweet. I ain't got much, but it'll do you more good out there than it will in here. Take what I got. Two doctor's bags included. Yay. You take care now. Okay, thank you, Doc Mitchell. You have been a great help, unlike Chet, who is a douche. Oh, I don't wanna... I'm gonna operate in this town, I'm gonna sell shit, but I don't wanna... I don't wanna fight the, uh, powder gangers. I'm a little puss. And Chet. Jerk. Okay, so what else do we have to do? What else do we have to do? Um... Acquire Easy Pete's Dynamite. Convince Chet. Return to Ringo. Okay, so we only have two things to do. Actually, before we go anywhere, let us go to the school. Where is the school at? Does the school not spring source cemetery? Whoops, my bad. Okay, apparently the school doesn't have unless this is it. Apparently the school doesn't have a a place where I can just fast travel to. 
Which kind of sucks, unless this is it. I'm trying to find that safe, but... If I can't find out where the school's at... And I will be somewhat screwed. Hmm. I really do not remember where the old school is at. Local map. Victor Shack. Son of a bitch. Now, I don't know where that school's at. Hey, who's this dude? What's he doing? Hello? Can you help me? Sure. My girl is trapped by geckos on the ridge, and I can't get to her. Please, she's going to die. You know, he didn't seem so concerned, just wandering around, not doing anything. Go up the path, past the broken radio tower, and go to the right. They're at the top of the trail. You will? Thank you for helping me. Please hurry. Where the fuck is this at? Go to the path up the right, past the broken radio tower, which I believe would be this. Because that is definitely one broke ass radio tower. Alright. Said she was up on a ridge over here somewhere. It's definitely a gecko. Maybe she's further up there. Come here, baby gecko. I got some bullets for you. Oh man, it's like that. No, don't you even run for me. Damn it. Oh, it's partially crippled. Oh god. It has a friend. Oh, pfft. that sucked. Oh no, I want no. Stop putting stuff into the gecko. Is it dead? No. Oh fucking! Come on. Oh, what the hell? It's like I. Oh, this is this is silly. Oh, ma oh my god. <laughs> uh, actually, hold on, hold on. I can't believe this is like this is turning into a Benny Hill skit. Who's ready? Who's ready for shotgun rain, huh? Who's ready for some shotgun rain? Shotgun rain is over here. Oh, there you go. There's some shotgun rain. There's some shotgun rain. Let's give let's give someone a Cobain. Cobained. There you go. Man, this. There's another Cobain. Ah. Whatever. Bah. I'm not even gonna loot these guys. Forget it. Okay. Where the hell is uh? Where the hell is this dude's girlfriend at? There's shit over here. Bah! Yeah. Can't get me, huh? Can't get me, huh? That's so who. That sucks. That really does suck. Sorry. Okay. Yeah, where the Thank God this game for the most point for the most part has like waypoints and shit. Otherwise I would just be I would just be lost all the time. There's like a ton of geckos and shit, so I can only imagine that this would be the right area to be going through. Oh shit. Yeah, screw you guys. These things make really weird sounds too. Goodbye. Where do you think you're going? Not going no- aw, oh, I'm out of ammo. And so the shotgun rain saga has ended. Wow. <laughs> I love that. Your weapon is in poor condition. It is definitely in poor condition. I can't get up here? Yes, I can. Yeah, I'm totally never gonna find this chick's, uh... This chick's... Sorry oh. I tricked you, but thanks for clearing out the geckos. Now I can get to that stash up there, after I deal with you. What a douche, I didn't even see the bear trap. Oh, fuck you. 
I did not even see the bear trap. That guy's a dick. Who does something like that? Let's go with a pistol. Yeah, that's what you get for being a douche. Man, that guy's chest got fucked up. Oh, let's take all that shit. Fucking stupid trap. Dude, oh no. He's got like... Ah, Search Johnny. Sure. Why is there like random balls and shit up here? Looked like his death was kind of painful. Can I kick him off the... This is Sparta! Yay. Alright. Wasn't even that good of a stash. There's like random bullshit in it. Bottle cat, I guess it was kind of worth it. Get some cards and stuff. Like an ashtray or something. That was bull. Actually, one thing I do need to do. One thing that I do need to do is, uh... Do, do, do. Now let's go ahead and put that there. That way I can just... I can just stim pack my way. My way to victory. Well, I guess we found out where his stupid girlfriend was at. You know, it was a trap. Wow, did that ball really roll like all the way over there? That's pretty, pretty funny. All right, so next time when we come back, we will uh, we will look to um, look to convince some more people to join us. Even though Chet's being a douche, and I don't think I'm gonna be able to get the dynamite from Pete because my my explosives is is incredibly low. But we'll be back in a little bit to continue on.